Well, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. How are you? Well, sorry, keep us in my ear. Ah! <laughs> okay, well, thank you so much for coming to my channel. I know you just saw my awkwardness. Yay! But today is going to be kind of something that most people don't think they can do or accomplish or they don't think there was a trick to it. Because I was talking to some of my girlfriends the other day and they're like, you can do that? I'm like, oh wait, I, I, I guess I forget at times that I know certain things and I expect other people to know what they are. Yeah, I, I need to get out of that. Anyways, it's basically how to curl your lashes, especially when you have kind of like mine, they like to drip down, they don't want to stay up, they're just like, mm. no matter what mascara you use, you have to, it's a mess. And even when you wear lashes, they still want to go down a little bit and you're always like, go up, stay up. It, I understand the struggle. Believe me, I understand the struggle. So I'm going to show you a little trick. It does have a little bit of a waiting time, but it's actually not too bad. It's actually kind of practical. So if you're ready to see what trick we can do with our lashes, keep watching. <laughs> okay, welcome back. Well, right now, let's get my hair out of the way. That way, you guys can see what I'm doing. Okay, so let me bring you a little bit closer where you can actually see my gorgeous eyes. Soulful eyes. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, this is as close as I can get you. See? Mm, nice face. And, and that's the thing I got pissed about like a second ago. I was just gonna add, you know, some makeup on me. And I am using the Too Faced Chocolate Gold Palette on my eyes, just in case you're wondering. I know, but looking like you should have recorded. Oh, but if you guys are interested in learning how I got this look with that palette, let me know. I'll be more than happy to recreate it. So, to be honest, one of the ways, as you can tell, I have no mascara in my lashes. This is my true natural lashes. I uh, know, very boring. So, you're gonna use is three items, literally three items, and even if it's one of those no makeup makeup days, because believe me, I have, <laughs> I have a few days, especially on a weekend, we just don't really do a lot of stuff. This is the trick that I use. Now, keep in mind, lashes, right? We have a few parts of our body, we have hair, like eyebrows, lashes, hair. Depends if you're male or female, but you, you get my point. Well, you have to treat it all, all the same. Treat your lashes kind of like your hair. You know when you want it curly or you want it straight? Because I ain't gonna lie, my hair is extremely curly. I'm in curly and wavy and it's, I, I absolutely hate it because it's a pain in the butt trying to brush through because tangles. Anyways, you have to use hot tools to make it work, right? Like for me, I'm able to keep my hair that way like forever, all day, and weeks until I wash my hair again. I know, it gets nice and gross. And anyways, so think of this, what you do to your hair, to your lashes. Now, one of the ways we, we get whatever texture we want in our hair is a hot curling iron, right? Either iron or straightener or whatsoever. Same thing with this. Normally, we would use a curler. Keep in mind, I do have, and I'm gonna say this wrong because I've always said it, and I do apologize if I'm mispronouncing it, because I, no, I am mispronouncing it, I know. And if you're the company, I'm so sorry. I just, I, I, I really don't know. I'm gonna write the name up here, the proper name of the eyelash color that I have. So, you know what? I'm, I'm not even gonna say it. Anyways, eyelash curler, and, and my new favorite mascara from One to Beauty. I'm gonna demonstrate how this works. But you're thinking, wait, but that's what we usually use, right? There's one last trick. <laughs> I'm gonna show you a third tool that you're very familiar with. You guys recognize this type of tool? I mean, we all have different kinds, obviously. A blow dryer. Just, just in case if you didn't know what that was, a blow dryer. So what you do is you get this, the eyelash curler. You put it, me personally, because I'm used to it, start low, start with love, don't burn yourself. And you're gonna heat this up for a few minutes. And you're gonna do a so. Oh, and I do apologize if the noise gets, ah, it's loud, because I'm really close to the camera and the microphone. <laughs>
It was just one of them. Sorry. It's one of the cover songs I've done and I have it in my head. Sorry. Anyways, you see how it is? But if you touch it, it's like ka. So blow it a little bit. I went a little bit longer than what I should. And so, so this is where I'm getting really close. I'm using my chair, not much of the lens, because the lens is as far as we can get. So basically you go with the eyelash curler. <laughs> let's let's pray I don't hurt myself because I don't have a mirror. I'm basically using the little bitty viewfinder. <laughs> okay, so basically, get your lashes as normal. And your pencil all the way down. Do not double clap, uh, double like do this action. Uh uh. Keep it nice and clamp. 10 seconds. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then, then you wiggle it. I don't know if you're able to see the difference between how that just went up and this droopiness over here. I1, I2. Now let's do it again on the other eye. Put the mascara on. Doing this without a mirror. No mirror, mirror challenge. Maybe I should do that. Let me know if you actually want me to do that. But then at the same time, that's kind of dangerous since I feel by myself. Um, I wouldn't know if the camera's recording or not. Okay. Now, as you see, that is my lash heated, and this one without. So let me do the other eye. Okay. So that's how the lashes are. Let's, well, at least for me, I like putting on the bottom lashes because. Bottom lashes always complete a look for me. You don't have to, but you see a little bit of a difference when you do a little bit of the bottom compared when there's nothing there. Okay. And now you're not completely done. You let your lashes dry, I would say a good 20 minutes. And you guys are thinking, oh, that's way too long. The problem is you're gonna do it again with the heater, but <laughs> as you, you know, you don't wanna do it while they're wet because the last thing you want is for it to crunch and like, you know, separate in. You have no lashes. So, but in this way it works out anyway, because then you can just finish up, at least for me, if you do eyes first. You do the foundation, your powders, your lipstick, or whatsoever. If I do have on, I'm gonna put it in the description below. <laughs> Sorry, I thought you may be a little bit like, okay, we saw too much of your face. <laughs> a little bit, uh, so yeah. So, <laughs> my mind's all over the place, I do apologize. And so, if you, like I said, if you're interested in a makeup look I have, let me know, comment below, I'll always, put all the products I use now, including the shade. That way you at least have an idea. So I'll be back. I'm be running around the house doing a couple of things. And once this dry, we'll be back. See you in a sec. Okay, I am back. So we're gonna do this again and see how they are in the last like a few minutes, a little bit up. So we're gonna try to heat up the curler again, but this time we're not gonna go, we're just gonna keep it there. Lightly, just just lightly, because the last thing we want is crunch. Okay, you're back to being really close to me. Congratulations. And you do it again, but very lightly. You keep it there, not too long. You feel the warmth, it'll be okay, you won't burn yourself. If it feels too hot, let go. Gently, and there you go. Let's do the other one. And that's it. So thank you for much for watching. I really appreciate it. I really hope you enjoyed this little mini tip on how to get your lashes to go up without false lashes. And it's just things that we have around the house anyway. So thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Please remember to push the little subscribe button as well as the notification bell. That way you're like, oh, her video's up. Got it. We're going. <laughs> you little watch it. As well as uh, follow me on all of my social medias at Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, and, and even on my Facebook at Any Blue Singer. I made the handle so easy and the same so you won't miss it. As well as my IMDb page, Any Lopez. Let me know if you want more videos like this of tips and tricks of what you can do. Uh, I'll make your life so much easier. And 
as I said, thank you so much for watching. I so appreciate it. And until next time, and remember, much love, good luck, remember good karma, and I'll see you next time. Bye!